Bart Simpson. Who the hell are you? Yes, the legislative branch comes through again. Uh, Mom, keep reading. Hmm. Quimby's cozying up to that sleazy video game producer. That really burns my beehive. I must hasten home to play my new carjacking game. <laughs> Give me your ride, jerk. Nothing a smile and some medical attention can't fix. Hmm, that video game's gonna turn every kid in town into stabby Sams and drive-by Bettys. Mom, I know how you could get that game banned. How? This manual tells us how to use superpowers. You mean I can talk to whales like Aquaman? Or do whatever Hawkman does? No, Mom. You have the power to convince crowds to do whatever you want. Just like Oprah. Okay, let's stop that video game. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
house, boss! Hi, diddly ho! Slice and dice it! Hey, if anyone sees my keys, I think I dropped them over there. Get him! I give this experience a check lot. in this round up since the gap started running ads with dancing. a year's worth of breaks at the cookie box. Everyone's invited to cast a plan to reach the team muscle. 
children won't be exposed to senseless violence. Lisa, burn that statue! Whoa, 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 Congratulations, Quimby. You made Grand Theft Scratchy Day a tremendous success. Thank you, Why don't we celebrate with some interns? Sexy interns? Well, Springfield sexy. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> I don't think he's coming out. We're going to have to use our secret weapon. No, Ned, not yet. I'm talking about Maggie. Uh, here is the Virgin. Incoming. Spit on your gum. Stay in school. <clears throat> don't let anything stop. So, I'm ready to receive my bribe now. Oh, baby, the dollar sign doesn't lie. God, we're not soaking, we're cooking! A mob of parents? A s -s 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 senator Quimby, you specifically promised me no mobs. You said this town was full of slugs who would suck up our sexy sleeves with a smile. Consider yourself unbribed. Unable to secure a decent bribe, I have decided to flip-flop and ban sales of Grand Theft Scratchy for minors, the only people who want to play it. Mom, isn't it a little bit hypocritical that you're opposed to the violence in the Itchy and Scratchy game, but then you use violence to get your way? I'm sorry, Lisa, what? I, I just can't hear you over the roar of this appreciative crowd. That was so, so awesome. I what I did. Oh, it that was, was the greatest day of my life. Oh, man, all my life I wanted to be a human garbage disposal, and now I was. Homie, don't you think you could put your new powers to better use? Oh, like what? Eat terrorists and bar flowers? What did you do that was so great? For your information, I rallied the town to ban a very violent video game. Mom, if kids don't play Grand Theft Scratchy, they'll never learn real-world skills. Like how to sell guns or hunt for hidden packages. You should talk, Bart. I heard that you destroyed half the Natural History Museum. And that's my favorite place to find solace. And while we're on the subject of yelling at each other, your little stud with the loggers has put an army of regular Joes out of work. Way to go! Way to ruin lives! Of all the stupid, fat idiots! You wouldn't know what to do with the superpower if your name Stop was Charles Well, yeah, your name, yeah, that's right, lame. Well, we're here, and it only took 300 decasols. You're the one who made us stop to visit your mother in space. Why do we always argue on spacecations? You're right, let's kill and space up.
catch up. Guys, listen. We've been given special powers. And if lazily written movies have taught me anything, it's that with superpowers come super responsibilities. So, on behalf of the town, let's go kick some alien butts. If they have butts to kick. Now, our powers aren't strong enough. We need to stop these spaceships. And there's only one person in Springfield who's smart enough to figure out how. I drank blue juice from under the sink. Oh, let's just find Professor Frank. <laughs> 